So ladies and gentlemen, I quickly want to show you something pretty interesting in the Crown Tundra. Now, I was going to cover this the other day because it was sent to me by Mr. Orange almost like the day after the Crown Tundra came out. This was sent to me, but I thought I might as well cover it right now. So there's this event for, you know, Oleana actually, really interestingly enough, uh, within the Crown Tundra. So first of all, you got to talk to Peonia and she's got to tell you this. Hey, have you heard the rumors about the long-haired woman? And apparently, night after night, she visits a grave in the Tundra, always looking for something. Now, if she's, after she tells you this, all you got to do is head outside and we got to go and find her. Now, you got to make sure that it is nighttime when you're doing this. You got to make sure it's nighttime or else this will not work. Just keep that in mind. It will not work if it is not nighttime. So we got to make sure it's nighttime, which you can change. Just got to go down into your system settings. Got to head down here, go to the bottom, go to system, and then change your date and, you know, and time and all that. Make sure, of course, to, you know, turn off synchronize with the internet. Go in here and change that to, you know, you know, midnight, for example, which is what I've almost done there. So back into the game now we've got to do is we got to get on our bike we got to head down to the area which is around where the uh you know the kind of cemetery is that sort of stuff around the graves down there so we're going to head down to it i'm going to show you where we're going to go and uh, we're going to see if we can find her so it's supposed to be oliana yes oliana the um, assistant to you know chairman rose if you guys remember her from the base game which you probably do uh she had a battle there as well so that you had to take her on in and all that sort of stuff but yeah we're gonna see if we can find her down here i think it is nighttime still uh yeah it should be nighttime right now it's just that it's so visible for me that i can't even really tell you know if it is nighttime or not but let's head down here and see if we can find her real quick she should be right down here so if you had followed along with where i've you know, been walking right now you should be able to find her as well so, here is what happens. Once you find Oleana, you just start talking to her, which, by the way, this footage is from Mix Ellie, as uh, my thing just didn't want to work out properly, as I've already kind of done the event, and I don't have a save file where I haven't done it. So, where or where could you be, my... And then she continues on, Miss Oleana, or a ghost. Now, as you'll see here, there's, you know, different responses for the prompts. And she says, I beg your pardon, there's no ghost here, only a <laughs> now mildly peeved Oleana. But with a stroke of luck, you may have just the information I need. Yes, we may do. Word has reached me that Chairman Rice has supposedly been seen in these parts. I know full word well cannot be true, but I cannot help to come and see. Would you happen to know anything about Mr. Rose's somehow being here in this tundra? I think I might. Sorry, I don't. So, you know, if you think I, I might, then guess what? It's going to be, you do, what do you know? Tell me straight away. Now, you'd also, you know, have uh, him pop it up. Hey, hey, chief, what brings you to these parts? Well, then, what if you just say Miss Oliana? Well, she'll have a more mild response. Oh, my champion, I didn't expect to find you here. But what a stroke of luck. You may have just the information I need. Hmm, where does Richmond Chairman Rose is supposedly be seen in these parts? I know full weather cannot be true, but hey, would you happen to know anything about Mr. Rose uh, being here in this tundra? Sorry, I don't. Well, no, I suppose you would not. Things are never as simple as that. Hey, Chief, what brings you here in the dead of night? And now she will react strangely, right? Because she will see him and she will think that Peony is M -M Mr. Rose? Well, well, is he Mr. Rose? I don't know. Come off at me, Rose. Talk about a mix up. Ah, no, it's not it. It's not it. It ain't it, Chief, dude. You, you're not Mr. Rose at all. Well, say it, Chief. Say it. But there is a slight resemblance. Could you be Mr. Rose's? Look closely. I can see you. <laughs> you do indeed lack his intelligence and grace. Ah, that's rude. Not that I particularly cl uh, close look is needed. Oh, Chief, do you know this Joker? Well, we kind of do. Gasp. Does this mean the Mr. Rose scene here was? <laughs> it was him. <laughs> Yes, it was Peony. I kind of love Peony. It's just great. And now I'm one extremely peeved Oleana. Yeah, you really are. She's kind of crazy, isn't she? You may be Mr. Rose's brother, but ultimately you and he are nothing alike. So yeah, confirmation that they are brothers. Uh, well, now that I know Mr. Rose is not here, I see no reason to linger. Farewell, champion. And likewise to you, that man over there. Um, okay, well, hey, hello. Uh, hello, have I reached the flying taxi service? I need to pick up from the Crown Tundra, please. Well, that sure was something. Yeah, it sure was, wasn't it? Still, even a bloke like him can inspire that much loyalty, eh? Yep, yep, clearly. Hmm, oh, I'm just talking to myself here. Don't mind me. Well, hey, your brother's so Well, better pack it in for the night before we get spirited away by some ghost. Ah, oh, spirited away reference. Beautiful. Gaha, nah, just having a laugh. Chase chief. And there it is. It's a pretty cool little event. Pretty cool little thing. I've got to say, it's pretty awesome. And also, if you check the lead card for uh, specifically, you know, uh, Peony, you will notice something interesting about him, which is that he actually is Peony's brother. Though this is seldom addressed publicly, Peony is in fact Rose's younger brother. Peony was compared to his brilliant brother since he was born, causing him to gradually rebel and become a delinquent. He eventually ran away from home, only to become a gym leader uh, once his talent was recognized. He even, he was even championed once, oh my god. But shortly afterwards, Rose became league chairman. Wow, that is, that is really crazy, man. 
This caused Peony to vanish entirely from the league. The Copperage on Peony's team has been there since it was a coffin. It was the first Pokemon Peony caught together with his brother. That is awesome bro that's such a cool piece of like lore and just backstory and i freaking love it and again shout out to mick selly for the footage you guys can go check out his video where it's just clean footage no talking ruffled rowlet over it definitely go check that out if you want to i just thought i'd make a video about this as well because i already knew about this event i just didn't have a way of doing it and then once i already did it i did good had no way to actually record it for you guys i just had the initial footage where i talked to the lady so uh, you know to uh peonia so yeah shout out to mick selly for the footage though and uh, yeah guys thank you so much watching drop a like down below make sure to subscribe and i'll see you all tomorrow for the next video